Welcome to the audio walk and run workout. If you are listening to this audio, then you are more than likely ready for the next exciting step of your running journey. Remember the biggest thing when you first start out running is establishing the habit, getting used to being on your feet. Whether you choose to walk or run the whole time today doesn't matter. It's more about keeping your body moving and staying motivated. Ideally, you will focus on a few minutes of running, followed by a few minutes of walking. So let's begin. We will always start by warming up the body with about five minutes of brisk walking. A good warm up makes it easier to get going and keep going. It'll boost blood flow to your muscles. Your joints will be more lubricated as synovial fluid starts to flow around them, helping them to work freely and easily. Good start. Keep your eyes forward, shoulders back and head upright. Pull your belly button in towards your spine to engage your core muscles. If you find yourself slumping forward, take a moment to correct your body position. If you notice you're holding tension in your shoulders and neck, relax and release them. Good posture will help you maintain speed